team buying the video mic NTG and the NTG5 was basically how well that these worked because they're they're pretty new on the market. Anyway, I just ended up deciding to go buy them um, and test them out myself and make you guys a video. So the whole point of this is to answer some of the questions that I didn't get answered in a different video that I watched. He had it, he, he was using it to use it to isolate his voice, but he had semis driving back behind him and that did not answer my question as to how well this isolates the voice in front of you and cancels out all the sounds that are coming on or going on behind or to the sides of the microphones. So before I waste all your time just talking about it like this, let's get to it. We have this quick clamp here set up on the roof rack using the road boom pole, the 85, super flattering, and we'll put that on here. You really gotta crank down on this to make it work really well. Otherwise, when you put that much weight out there, this thing wants to fall. So, in fact, I think it's falling now. Uh, I'm gonna have to fix it and maybe change where I have this at, but anyway. So I had this set up and I think when I put my sunglasses on, the auto face detection stopped. And uh, yeah, so when the auto face detection stopped, we, we was out of focus, I was out of focus. And so that, as good as maybe the sound might be coming through the boom mic of the NTG5, that ain't fun to watch me be blurry and all you saw was, maybe you don't look like looking at my face, so maybe the mountains was better, but I'm redoing it. Um, but yeah, so I'm filming on the 1DX Mark II, recording on the NTG, or the video mic NTG, and the NTG5 on my boom pole, which is hooked up to the car and all that fancy stuff. We have the freeway behind us and people that honk and stuff. So I really wanna see how this cancels out that noise of, you know, some people. You know what's crazy is like, yeah, it's just me and I don't really care too much uh, if someone's honking. But you know, if you're driving by, like it looks like a full on video set and you have what looks like people recording sound with a boom pole out here, like it kind of, it, it's kind of rude to honk, especially given the fact that you might, I mean, that's their time and you're kind of, you know, biting into their time. So um, if it was you there, think of it like that. Would you want people honking when you've got lines going on or people staying apart or whatever? So just something to think about. But honestly, I just wanted to really just get out here and see how this cancel out the noise. So if people honk, great, that's awesome because that actually kind of helps me know when this is picking up noise or when it's not. And so, and how well it isolates my voice from a lot of the stuff out behind. And basically, yeah, we have this freeway going along. And so I also wanted to do a test and compare the video mic NTG with the NTG5. A lot of people think that they are the same mic and they are not. So basically, you're listening to the NTG5 now, and now you're listening to the video mic NTG. And back to the NTG5. And back to the NTG video mic. So anyway, we're gonna go back to the video mic, or not the video mic, but the NTG5 and Basically just end on that note, I think. Uh, that's just a little bit of a comparison. I watched a video, this guy did a comparison with the NTG5. 
and I think he also did the video mic NTG, but when he did the outside comparison, he had the camera where you guys are, and me, and then the freeway behind him. He had I-80 behind him, and and it was good, but it like basically it's a shotgun mic, so if it's pointing, wherever it's pointing, it's gonna pick up the sound. So if I turned this microphone right now and pointed it at the freeway, we would get the sounds of the freeway. And that's not, that doesn't help me make a decision when I wanna buy a shotgun mic, is I wanna know how well it isolates the sounds from behind. Like I don't want those sounds in the track. And basically that is what I'm going for with this test is to show you guys how this sounds when I have a freeway basically we're probably I don't know 100 300 feet no probably two to three hundred feet uh, to my right so um, yeah there you go let me know what you think if you're here from TikTok comment below say what up uh, please subscribe to this channel if you have not if you found me in the search please hit that bell button and get notified every time that I upload a video and yeah, so thanks guys, appreciate it. Catch you on the next one. I hit that, so that is, that is on. Take that out of my gear. And so that lets me have this audio plug into the camera. So, there you have it. Um, yeah.